This is a 2012 Mini Cooper S Roadster, two-seat convertible, has 54,000 miles, brand new tires, run flats, they're over $900, 17-inch rims that comes with the sport package, um, has a new battery, new brakes, it has all the maintenance before any of the intervals were due, oil changes with synthetic as recommended. Uh, instead of every 15,000, I think the factory says I do every 5,000 um, with all my vehicles. It has been garage kept. First owner, I ordered it from the factory. Um, it was built for me and shipped over on a boat. It has um, been all the miles have been commuting miles because I live over an hour away from work so they're all highway miles let's go and open the doors to the interior it has the Harman Kardon upgraded um, speakers I'll just show you in behind the seats there's storage room um, behind both seats inside that seat goes forward um, and this opens up to the trunk in case you have something kind of long to take home let's see so there's the mileage I think it's gonna focus 54,100 um, it has the um, electronics system so you can link your iPad with it and have your phone and everything on Bluetooth. Um, let's see, heated seats, I got the outdoor or cold weather package with the heated seats and uh, this is also the armrest which lifts up but you can put your iPad in there at the back there's um, a link that it plugs into and the headrests of course go up and down uh, um, there's different colored lighting, mood lighting you can change, uh, you know, rainbow color choices. Um, I have all the records for all the maintenance in the original manual in there. Let's see. So CD player and of course um, Bluetooth with the radio and then your your apps. If uh, there's office and stuff. If you have an iPhone or a smartphone, you can link it. Um, it has, uh, of course, cruise control, and then your radio controls with your head, uh, your telephone control at your fingertips. Um, it has voice command, so you can talk and get change your uh, radio to CD or call someone. Uh, it has voice voice command. Let's see. Let's open the trunk. So it has a very large trunk, hard to see with the shadow, but um, there's also extra uh, storage down in there. I don't know why they have a cover, but so it holds really unbelievable amounts of groceries or whatever you need to bring home. Let's see. So I'll flip the passenger seat forward. So there's room back behind the passenger seat for storage as well. And then they have the recline lever actually is on the inside. Kind of interesting. Um, my mats are out here drying. I washed them. Oh, looks like I ran over them. Need to clean those again. What else? Oh, let's put the top down. So the top has just this handle that you turn. And then, I can't do it with that hand. I gotta go the other side. Sorry. That's what happens when you're right-handed. Okay. You can do this from inside the car. And then it latches there. So then the release lever is here. But now, 
Uh, oh yeah, I have tinted windows. That's not factory. So that stores down in a really nice, compact, neat, and wind-efficient way. A lot nicer than the regular mini convertibles. This model is turbocharged. It has sport suspension um, at the push of a button, which really tightens up the steering and the suspension for tight corners or higher speeds. So, of course, power windows. Window controls are here. All these, they call it aviation toggles. So, that's how it looks. Top down, windows down. It's very, very cute. It's been very well kept. I think I already said, but garage kept. Even at work, we have covered parking. Um, oh, I upgraded the headlights, the automatic uh, nighttime sensing headlights, uh, halogen, and then I upgraded to the black background. It just looked nicer. Um, what else? I still have some water drops. I just washed it. So I think that's about it.